fix iPhone errors with Phone Lab iOS system recovery. iPhone is really a good gadget in modern life. People use it for work, entertainment, study, business, communicate, etc. It almost occupies the entire part of people's life. However, no matter how excellent the iPhone performs, it is impossible to have something that works perfect without any errors, neither the iPhone is. Therefore, there are some simple but useful tips for you to solve these problems. 1. Restart iPhone. Just like restarting a computer often fixes problems, restarting your iPhone sometimes works wonders. For iPhone 8 and earlier, you should Step 1. Press and hold the power button. Step 2. Slide the red slider, then the device will be turned off. Wait for a few seconds till the screen turns black. Step 3. Press and hold the power button to restart the device. For iPhone X, you should Step 1. Press and hold the wake sleep button and either volume button until the slider appears. Step 2. Drag the slider to turn it off. Step 3. Press and hold the wake sleep button again until you see the Apple logo. 2. Soft reset iPhone. Soft reset is helpful when your apps are not responding properly or it is not able to get important functions to work. Below are the steps for how. Step 1. Press and hold the power button and home button for about 10 seconds until the Apple logo appears. Step 2. Just wait and then it will restart again in a few seconds. If you know well about iPhone X, you should have known that it is designed without a home button. So you should reset it with below tutorial. Step 1. Press and quickly release the volume up button. Step 2. Press and release the volume down button which is the same as the volume up button. Step 3. Press and hold the power button for at least 10 seconds until you see the black screen. Step 4. Holding the power button and release when the device... Well, the following way is different from the one mentioned above. 3. Hard reboot device. Hard reset iPhone will wipe the data on your iPhone. It will require you to back up your iPhone data if you want to restore these data back to your device after that. There are several simple methods to back up iOS data. Below is a tutorial to back up iPhone data with iCloud. Step 1. Make sure that iCloud backup is turned on in settings, your name, iCloud, iCloud backup. Step 2. Tap backup now. Then it takes some time to complete according to the size of your data. After backing up your data, you can read below steps to hard reset your iPhone. There are two methods as below. You can choose one according to your needs. Option 1. Step 1. Tap Tap General in the Settings app. Step 2. Scroll down to tap Reset. Then choose Erase All Content in Settings when you see the six options. Step 3. Tap Erase iPhone. Then the device will begin restoring the phone to its original factory settings. Step 4. Your device will be restart after the process is complete. Option 2. As mentioned in Option 1, it is a method to restore your iPhone on itself directly. If you would like to use the computer, follow the steps below. Step 1. Launch iTunes on your computer and connect your device to the computer with USB cable. Step 2. Click the device icon once the device is detected. Step 3. Click Summary from the left panel, then Restore iPhone in the iPhone section. Step 4. You will be asked to back up your iPhone data after that. Go ahead if you want. Then click Restore. Step 5. After the process is finished, set up your device when it restarts. 4. Recovery Mode. Because iPhone 8 doesn't have a physical home button and iPhone X doesn't have one at all, Recovery Mode is accessed via a series of button presses. iPhone 8, iPhone 8 Plus, or iPhone X Step 1. If iTunes is open on your Mac, close it. Step 2. Plug your USB to lightning cable into your computer. Step 3. Plug your USB to lightning cable into your iPhone. Step 4. Open iTunes. Step 5. Press and release the volume up button and then the volume down button. Then, press and hold the side button until you see the connect to iTunes screen. iPhone 7 or later. Step 1. 
Turn off your iPhone 7 if it isn't off already. Step 2. Press and hold down the volume down button on your iPhone 7. Step 3. Plug your iPhone 7 into your Mac or Windows PC and make sure iTunes is running. Step 4. Release the volume down button. When you see the connect to iTunes screen, iPhone 6s are earlier or iPad. Step 1. Turn off your iPhone, iPod Touch, or iPad if it isn't off already. Press and hold down the on off button on the right side, iPhone 6 or later, or top, all other iPhones, iPods, and iPads for 3 seconds. Swipe the slide to power off confirmation slider to the right. Step 2. Press and hold down the home. 5. Factory reset. To reset your iPhone or iPad, go to Settings, General. Reset and then select Erase All Content and Settings. Then follow the instruction to confirm the resetting. 6. Phone Lab iPhone Data Recovery. There is an easy to use and comprehensive iOS system recovery tool, Phone Lab iOS System Recovery, which has the ability to fix all kinds of iOS system issues, including iPhone stuck in recovery mode, DFU mode, or frozen on the death screen of white, black, blue, or red and more iOS abnormal situations. Step 1 Download and install the program to your Windows or Mac OS computer. Step 2 Connect your iPhone to the computer when the installation is done. Choose iOS system recovery feature after the software detected your device. Step 3 The software can detect the connected devices in abnormal state like iPad stucks on Apple logo, recovery mode, DFU mode, iPhone black screen, etc. and it will ask you to click the start button to get started. Step 4 You will have to download the firmware for your device in order to make it normal. So you will be asked to confirm the information on your iPhone. Click repair if it is correct, but if not, select the exact information manually before repair. After that, let the software complete the downloading. This solution works effectively on iPhone iPad and iPod. With the help of the software, you can overcome almost all iTunes errors within a few clicks.